Okay, we're going to look at determining the mass spec for a diatomic element, and we're going to look at bromine. Okay, the problem states that bromine consists of two isotopes, bromine-79 and bromine-81, each with a percent abundance of 50%. Okay, so bromine exists as a Br2. There are two isotopes that could be either one of these atoms in that bromine molecule. Okay. So if we look at this bromine molecule bonded, one of these could be a 79, and sometimes the other one is also going to be the 79 isotope. We could have the bromine molecule existing of both bromines. We could also have a 79 bromine bonded with an 81 bromine. And to look at all of the different possibilities, we would also write that kind of backwards like that. Hmm. Okay. So to determine what kind of masses are going to show up on that mass spec, we kind of have to look at the probabilities of these different um, molecules. So if the 79 atomic mass unit isotope has an abundance of 50%, we can say the probability of this being the first molecule is a half. Probability of it being the second is a half. So this is going to be one quarter. Probability that the mass of bromine is going to equal 79 times 79. No, plus. Or 158. If we look at the next one similarly, I always, this is supposed to be a 2. Half times a half, 25% of the time, I'm likely to get a Br2 molecule that has a 162 atomic mass unit. These two are kind of the same, each a half, and then each one a half. add these, and I get 50% of the time I'm going to have a bromine molecule, or at least likely to have a bromine molecule, that is 160 atomic mass units. So that's using probabilities. So when we draw what we assume the mass spec is going to be, we are going to have 158. This is going to be the mass in atomic mass units. We have 158, 160, and 162. This is your percent abundance. And we will have um, 25, 50, 75. 158 is a quarter, which is 25%. So we should have a peak like that. 160, it should go up to 50, that should be to 50, oof, goodness. Okay. So we would expect the mass spec of bromine with its two isotopes to look like that.